In 2016, the Kingdom of Swaziland staged its first capital market in Daba. The second edition of this momentous meeting that is already underway at the convention center at Ezulini was officially opened by the Prime Minister, Dr. Panaba Sibusisol Damini. When addressing the meeting, the Prime Minister touched on the challenge faced by regulators and legislators in terms of creating a stable regulatory environment for investors. He also shed some light on what would it take to grow the capital market sector in the kingdom. The challenge for regulatory authorities and legislators will be to develop a stable regulatory environment that gives investors and project developers the incentives and confidence for the use of the capital markets. For healthy growth, the capital markets require an optimal supply of funds and willing users of those funds. But in our primary market, there is, owing to the recent regulations, a very substantial amount of funds available from the financial institutions with only limited demand, mainly from the government, for those funds. In the secondary market, the Southern Stock Exchange, there is a similarly a substantial amount of funds primarily from the financial institutions, but also from individual, individuals available to buy a minimum quantity of equities and unit trusts that are available for purchase. The Prime Minister pointed out the need for the Swaziland Stock Exchange to draw more companies like Swazi Mobile and the importance of listing their shares in the Swaziland Stock Exchange. He says stakeholders like FSRA must make capital markets more attractive for investors. Taking first the secondary market, our Swaziland Stock Exchange, we can look forward to the promised new listing of Swazi Mobile and the availability of those shares on the stock exchange in the near future. There is a continuing need to draw companies into the equity markets, promoting to privately held companies the advantages of the Southern Stock Exchange listing of those shares and helping to introduce new financial, financial instruments into the market. There is a need for stakeholders such as the FSRA and the Swaziland Stock Exchange to reflect creatively about changes that can make our capital markets more attractive to investors, including improved marketing of investment projects. Capital markets can play a pivotal role in supporting economic growth in Swaziland like it is happening in other African states. For Swazi TV News, I'm LinkedIn Kule with Sibuzi Songobane at the Convention Center.